Good morning, muchachos. It is currently 10:21. We've been on the road for almost an hour, about 40 minutes. Um, but yeah, so we're all here. Alondra's on her tablet back there. She's like, "Why is this taking so long?" It's like, do you not remember the drug? Yeah, Poppy's gonna get you an icy. It's funny because every single time we go to San Antonio, um, well, actually, anytime we ever pass the Bucky's, so we always stop, and they have a huge icy machine. Well, they have like three different icy machines with like different flavors. They even have a Dr. Pepper icy, which I've never seen before. So, anyways, Alondra loves icies. I do too. And so she was like, I want an icy. So, and we were gonna stop at Bucky's anyways. It takes us about, what? Two and a half hours, two hours to get to Bucky's? About two and a half, two hours, being on traffic to get to Bucky's um, from where we live. So, it's not bad. Like halfway point to your dad, like literally halfway point to your dad. Yeah, so maybe it's about, yeah, cause it should only take us like five to five and a half hours to get to my dad's, but it always takes us six hours driving literally six hours driving or and it, it takes more because we do stop um we usually stop maybe two to three times and then when we have wiggles we stop sometimes a little bit more it just depends um but yeah we always stop at bucky's because number one the bathroom and then number two just to like get drinks kind of refresh stand up if we need to get gas but have we ever gotten gas at bucky's just once i feel yeah so we had stops yeah, I might as well just get gas. Yeah, we oh, whenever we stop somewhere, like if we have to like, st if, I mean, if we have to stop before Bucky's, then we do. We try to make it all the way there. But like, if, obviously, if she needs to go to the bathroom, we're gonna stop. Um, so yeah, whenever we stop, we always get gas on road trips. Like we don't care. We just always get it because you just never know. So just to be safe. So, anyways, yeah, I went to the post office before we um. What do you call it? Before. Yeah, leaving. Thank you, honey. I can't talk. So before leaving, I stopped at the post office. I had to do like a bunch of stuff. So I updated my name. So um, if you guys ever send anything in the P.O. box, which by the way, Kim, I got your Christmas card. I am so sorry. I had no idea. If you would have wrote a comment, I would have checked it sooner, I swear. So I'm sorry that I haven't said anything. I, I hope you didn't think this whole time that I had it and then I just never said thank you. So because that would make me feel really bad. But I just got it super cute um, and so I appreciate the Christmas card so thank you Kim um, so yeah I checked my PO box I also had like a bunch of like mail from somebody else that doesn't belong well I, that was a previous owner so I had to turn that in I updated my name on the PO box I updated my name like for mail but actually no she said I didn't have to update my name I just needed to put like this sticker in my mailbox like where we live so I'm gonna put that sticker I got that sticker and then I bought five books of stamps which do you know how much five books of stamps is honey how many stamps that is 100 one million dollars austin powers anyone nope all right so yeah I, it's 100 stamps which basically is a roll and i was gonna buy stamps at costco because they sell a roll 100 stamps at costco and i was like nah because they only give you the like american flag ones and i really wanted designs well, my post office didn't have any designs. They only gave me the American flag ones. And the reason why I would have rather gotten it at Costco is because if we used our Costco credit card, we would have got cash back. So, missed out on that opportunity. But anyways, I want to let you guys know, I think I talked about it in my plan with me on Monday, if you watched my plan with me. But in case you guys don't watch my plan with me, which is totally fine, and in case you do not know, you're not aware, the post office is raising the price of postage stamps by five cents. And my plan with me, I was like, I'm pretty sure it's five cents, but I wasn't like 100% sure. I gotta switch arms, but it is. It is five cents because the lady's like, do you need stamps? Which I did anyways, I had to mail something. Um, and I was like, yeah, I wanna buy a bunch of stamps. So anyways, yeah, um, it is five cents they're raising the price by, which is the highest amount, I guess, that they've ever raised stamps. Like usually it's two cents, three cents, a penny, but this is five cents they're raising it. And it takes effect on the 26th. And then she said too, like, you won't be able to buy forever. She made it seem like you can't get forever stamps after that. I should have asked her to clarify, cause like, I got kind of confused. I was like, what? But anyways, I don't know, maybe that's why they don't have designs anymore. I don't know. But so yeah, she was like, I would definitely get as much books of stamps as you can because they last forever. So if you're not familiar with forever stamps, 
that's what it means. It, it lasts you forever. So as long as they don't change the system, you can keep this thing of stamps and not use them for two, three years, maybe longer, and it's still gonna be whatever price you paid two, three years ago. I hope I'm making sense. Did that make sense to you when I said that? Maybe. Sometimes I talk and I'm like, am I even making sense? Like I know what I mean in my head, but sometimes I can't like articulate what I'm trying to explain. But hopefully that makes sense. So even if you're not like a person who really nails a lot, just get a book. It's, tw it's 20 stamps. A book of stamps is 20 stamps. Um, so yeah, just get like a book. But yeah, I was like, yeah, I really wanted to get a bunch because obviously I pay more up front now, but technically in the long run I'm saving money. And I do mail, not often, but I do mail um, stuff. And I want to like set up on my desk like a little like mail center with those like, I think I showed you guys, like I still have like photos and like random stuff in it, but like the three tiered thing on my desk. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make that like a mailing center. Cause I have like our name with like our address on it. So like for that, I'll put my stamps there and I have like two different sizes of envelopes and so I'll put that there. So that way, like whenever we need to mail something or if Yadon needs to mail something, he can just go to like the little like mailing center, grab it and you know, I think that would be really cute and that would be like very convenient as well. So that's what I'm gonna do, I've decided. But um, oh, you're tired baby. Poor thing, he is tired. One of his buddies came in from town so he saw him last night. Um, so yeah, he got home pretty late. I was already asleep actually. Um, but yeah, then he woke up the same time as me. So he got less sleep than me. And he's driving because he wanted to, by the way. In case anyone's like, wow, he got no sleep and you're making him drive? No, <laughs> he wanted to drive. So just to defend myself in case anyone's thinking that. But anyways, yeah, the vlog did go live today. I had edited it last night and I got it all scheduled to go live today at 7 a.m. So if you haven't checked out the vlog, definitely check it out if you want to, of course. But um, yeah, I don't know if a vlog's gonna go up today on Tuesday, or no. The vlog's gonna go up on Wednesday, like this vlog, because like I said, we're gonna be at my dad's. So um, I think I explained it in yesterday's vlog, but just in case I'm explaining it now. So hopefully I can still get this to go up on Wednesday. But anyways, my hand's getting tired. We are currently listening to True Crime Garage, which is an awesome podcast. It's two guys. I don't know if they're in a garage, but I feel like they are in a garage. But it's two like older guys and um, they talk about beer, not like all the time, but yeah, they like have like a new brew of like the podcast or whatever. I don't know, they're pretty funny, like their commentary, we enjoy them, and they talk about true crime, so missing cases, murder, and I really like it, so I highly suggest it. So I always watch, listen, I was gonna say watch, I always listen to True Crime Garage, which is them, and then I also listen to, I think it's just called Unsolved Murders, I really like that one too. That one is a guy and a girl, like commentary for people, and um, it's all unsolved murders, which is kind of like, uh, because you want to know what happened. But um, I like it because they have, like, they don't act it out, but they have like behind the scenes while, while they explain stuff, like people acting, if you can hear it. I don't know. Those are my two favorite podcasts right now. So comment down below if you have any favorite podcasts. Let me know what your favorite ones are. I personally love like murder and true crime. So if you have some favorites of those, let me know. But all right, I'm going to go listen to this. And we will check with you guys later, so why don't we just go ahead and cue the montage. Bucky's gonna go to the restroom, get Alondra an icy. I'm gonna get a drink and maybe something to snack on because I'm really hungry. Oh my god, are these actual? <gasps> They're real birds. I'm not kidding when I told you guys there's so many dang birds out here. Like, look at them all. Oh my god, I hate birds. All right, baby, what color icy you want? You want the blue or the red one? I want the green one. You want a green one? I don't know if they have green. Let's see. Yeah, that one's yellow. It's lemonade. Let's see, they have some down here. You want yellow? Are you sure you're gonna like that? That's lemonade. No, no, no. No. <laughs> they got the cherry one here. Oh yeah, I want that blue one. The blue one? All right, there's your icy. All right, mommy's gotta go get her soda now. One thing I love about this place is they have 20 ounce, 32 ounce, and 44 ounce drinks, and look how cheap. 79 cents, 69 cents, 59 cents. 
I just get this one because honestly, I can't even finish one of these. So I'm just gonna get this one here. And 69 cents, you cannot beat that. Oh my God, you guys, they have Coke. I seriously have always come here and I've only ever seen Pepsi products, so I always get a Dr. Pepper, but I mean, you can see they have like a million different stations. This is the very last station and look, just the Coke all by itself. Yes! Look at this, I never knew that like, I always saw this, but I never actually paid attention to it. Like I just like, oh, thought you just walked up and picked food, but you can come here and actually order food. So I'm gonna get a laundry of grilled cheese. What does it say? Tater tots for, or beaver tots for free. Uh, yeah, yes please, free, it's for me. We want one. This is pretty cool. That's my grilled cheese. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna keep looking then and look at the menu and see what else I can get. Oh uh, yeah, we're definitely getting mine. lots of goodies. See you mine. see yours? Right there, right there. Mm, I'm so excited. We got a lot of stuff at Bucky's. We're still in the parking lot. We're trying to like doctor up our food, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you the food. What did you get? Taters. Yeah, so she got a grilled cheese sandwich and tater tots. You guys, $3. I mean, and it's a lot of food. You can't really probably tell, but it's a lot. And then I, I got the three-piece. Oh, man. Oh, you got the wrong thing? I got the chopped brisket, not the... Oh, you know, I got a brisket sandwich, but he grabbed the wrong hey. brisket one. Oh, pause. pause. And then I got the three-piece chicken meal. I get Texas toast, french fries, and then I also got gravy and ketchup. And it was like, what, baby? Oh, it was like five dollars and eighty-seven cents, and one sandwich is five ninety-nine. So I got all this food for cheaper than that. We ended up getting the forty-four ounce drink for seventy-nine cents because, well, we're both feeling extra thirsty. So yeah. Um, and then we got more stuff here. I'm just gonna <laughs> Yeah, go ahead. We got chips. So Alondra picked these out. These are Alondra's favorite chips. So she grabbed them and threw them in the basket, which was actually kind of funny when she did it. And then Idam got the Cheetos Flamin' Hot, the Puffs version. Are these the Puffs? Mm -hmm. Yep. And then we got fudge, which, oh, I'm trying to bend down to grab it. It's gonna be hard. But it was buy four pieces of fudge, get two for free. And my dad is obsessed with fudge. I love fudge too. But my dad loves some fudge. So just kind of like as a little thank you for watching Wiggles, I thought I would bring him some fudge. And it was actually my what? wonderful husband's idea. Know, Best son in law right here. I was looking at you like. No, that was. No, I picked you... out the fudge. I picked it out. <laughs> I was like. Take but that was credit. his idea. No, I didn't yeah, take credit. I yeah, Laundra picked out an M&M one. I got a red velvet. I don't know. I got six pieces. But anyway, so yeah, my dad loves fudge. And best son-in-law right here remembered and was like, we should get your dad some fudge as a thank you. And I'm like, good one, babe. Good one. So, oh, wait. Where's your sausage? <laughs> your mom also got a sausage. I a big tried. sausage thingy but, but all right. We're going to go ahead and eat. I'm so hungry. The french fries are good. And, um... Yeah. Three hours later. Hi, Rikos. Hi, Rikos. Hi. Who is that, Alondra? Is it Wiggles? Is that your puppy? Careful. Is that your puppy? Hi, Wiggles. Hi. Hi, pretty girl. Yay, Wiggles. Are you happy, Mama? We are taking her home. Yeah, we're taking her home. Are you happy? Yeah. Hey, Oh yeah, she's super hyper. She's happy to see you. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Wiggles. Hi. Oh, there we go. Look at that pretty face. Are you calm now? Are you calm now? Are you calm? Oh, Wiggles. Hi. It is currently 3.30. We literally just got into my dad's house maybe two minutes ago and reunited with Wiggles. No one's here except for my stepmom right now. So anyway, yeah, we're just putting our stuff in our room, giving Wiggles the extra lovin's cause we missed her so much. Are you ready to go home Wiggles? Yeah, I feel good. bad for Wiggles. I feel like Wiggles is not gonna wanna go with us because here at my dad's, she has all of this property to run around so she can just go like off a leash and she does and she just roams wherever she wants to roam. She has Spring to play with, the other dog, and then she has like my two brothers that like play with her and then she also has my stepmom who gives her lots of treats and makes her fat. So I feel like she's, she's I bet you why Wiggles is like, I why are they here? I'm happy to I see you, her. but I don't want to go with you. I have yeah, a feeling I that's do. how it is. Do you think she wants to come with us? Okay, maybe. I know she loves us. I know she missed us, but I don't know. I bet inside she's like, darn it. They're taking me away. Now I have rules and diet. She's hyper? She is. She's really hyper. But, oh, is that my phone going off? 
Yes, it is. Oh my God. Always scam likely phone calls. I've seriously today gotten five scam likely calls. It is the most annoying thing in the world. Do you guys get those calls too? Yeah, I'm and I get them all the time. But lately, as of like the past three days, I've been getting scam likely calls nonstop. It's driving me nuts. I know. But all right, we just got here, so I'm gonna go spend some time with my stepmom, hang out, and yeah, so I'll talk with you guys a little bit later. Are you making cupcakes with Mima? Oh wow, hi Mima. Hi. <laughs> you did the eggs? Oh, yummy, yummy. You got some joke on your hand? Did she pour the oil? You did the oil? Yeah. Wow. And what are we gonna do with this? Sprinkles. Oh, finally, Dad, I've been waiting all day for you. Your son in law was like, hey, doesn't your dad really like fudge? And I was like, oh yeah, he does. All right. Well, look what he got you. Thank you. Yeah, I can't take credit. That was all him. But I can't take credit for picking out the fudge. I picked those out. Yeah, I took all of my strength not to eat it in the car. I was like, oh my God, it smells so good. I know, I got red velvet, Ooh. peanut butter chocolate. What is this that is one? Like, Rocky is, Road, Rocky I think. Rocky Road, yeah, because marshmallows. M&M, and then this is the salted caramel. She said this is the best one, so I got both of those. Oh, cool. I know. So, um, yeah, we need to dig in. My stepmom informed me that we have presents that she forgot to give it to us. So, oh yeah. Look at your pajamas. Oh, really? Wow. Yeah, so those are Alonja's Christmas pajamas. I got some too right here. We got matching. So we got those. And then I have two presents. And then Iram has two presents. So we're going to go ahead and open them. Okay, you go first, Daddy. Oh, first? Yeah, you go first. Look at this. The surprise Christmas. How nice is that? What is it? Oh, yeah, I made some. Let's say it's a black I, box. I told you basically, hey, Whoa! Yeah, okay. Is that Jack Daniels? Oh, oh my that's gosh! A that's a special Jack Daniels, my dad said. Oh! oh. Whoa! That is cool. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. It's an FBI SWAT one. Yep. Wow! For our 45th, anniversary. 45th anniversary? That is cool! Wow! The SWAT logo! That's so cool! But he needs to be counting that, uh, hey, you're here to get freaking divorced, so get the Alright! Daddy got some boxing gloves. Uh, whatever, remember, I got some too from my dad, so. So. <laughs> put them up, put them up. Somebody sent me some stuff. my turn. Yeah. I never said that. That's right. Not too. What to say? Oh, this is. Oh, this is okay. I thought this was a little one. Believe in something even if it means sacrificing everything. This is cute. Oh, that's how we get hurt. I'm okay. I'm sad. Oh, look! And it. I think it lights up. I know. I think that's what it says. Light up. We got the instructions in there. Ooh, it's glass too. So we're going to have to be extra careful. So oh, I see how you light it up. Huh? Huh? For the tree. For the tree. The lights up? Yeah. But we have to be careful because we don't want to break well, guess what? it. Guess what? Alonja's birthday was. Thank you, Dad. Ooh. Thank you, Claudia. Oh my gosh, a birthday present! Look at all these presents. Oh my goodness! Oh, that's Look my, at her. That's my present. Alonja's birthday was. No, that's Alonja. my birthday present. What is it? What is it? <gasps> wow! What is, what is this? Papa. All oh, bubbles, Paw Patrol. Wow! That is cool, Mama. What is that? A ball. Throw it. Throw it to Daddy. Oh. 
<laughs> All right, we'll, we'll craft it. Oh, look, it lights oh, up. Oh, it lights up. It has lights inside. Yeah. Oh, she was like, I want like this. Like that. You see your ball? Get the batteries. That's the batteries for this one. Oh, that's the batteries for that? Because okay. The, the, oh, that's the bubbles come out of it. Oh. <laughs> Wow! I get this text message on my way home. My AAA battery. What do you say? Thank you, Mima. And Grandpa. And grandpa. Say thank you, Grandpa. It's you're Give hugs to Grandpa. Look, he looks Give hugs to Grandpa. Oh. <laughs> we are currently playing the longest game of pool ever. It I'm playing the guitar. Oh yeah! I think they saw that when you opened up your birthday presents. Yeah, we have just one ball to get in, plus the eight ball. And my dad and Claudia have three, plus the eight ball. So hopefully we win this game, but this has been like the longest game ever. So, fingers crossed. Right now, Claudia is getting ready to hit the striped red ball number 11. Will she make it? Oh, oh, oh. That was a very good try. <laughs> All right, babe, you can do it. Get that red ball, get that red ball. Get... Oh, oh God, we've got that on camera too. <laughs> <laughs> Let's cut that out, please. <laughs> All right, Dad. Oh, oh my God. Let's <laughs> see, Wendy. What? Oh, the door. Oh. And yeah. Oh. One ball and one ball. Will dad make it in? Oh, 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 oh. No. All right, it's up to me. Hit it as hard as you can. Yeah, Dad. Your keys, it goes into the hole. Okay, I guess I'm going to do that one over there. Oh, God. No! 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 Yeah! Oh! 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 Oh!
Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Yes. So I hope you guys enjoyed hey, today's vlog. vlog. Hey, Sasa.